Yo, what is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking Jealous 84 here recruiting another Rising Star for you guys. Uh, you guys remember the last time I recruited a Rising Star was Cardell Patterson and uh, Tadavian Clowney and also Jason Morrow. Those are my current three Rising Stars. Well, recently they put out a new one and his name is Derek Carr from the Oakland Raiders. And after I saw a few of his stats, I was like, you know, this guy looks similar as Ryan Tannehill, but also I saw that he was going to be added plus seven on his overall. So I was like, maybe he's better than Ryan Tannehill. So I ended up buying, you know, two of his cards, which is um, the ground and pound skill one, because in order for you to get double ground and pound, you got to buy two Derek cars that are the same scale. So that's exactly what I did. As you can see here, uh, Derek Carr is not that expensive compared to Jason Morrow, to David Clowney, and Cardell Patterson, because those cards. You know the original 80 overalls they went like for around 20,000 so I'm lucky Derek Carr is going like for around 4,000 which is kind of weird because this guy looks like he has skills so you should be able to see how they compare to each other Ryan Tannehill and Derek Carr because I believe Derek Carr can actually lead me to the Super Bowl you know Ryan Tannehill had his moment like season 2 uh, when he went 13 and 0 but I believe Derek Carr can have his moment also you know uh, I believe that this guy can actually roll out a lot better than Ryan Tannehill maybe throw a lot more better passes I don't know but I am hoping I'm putting my faith into Derek Carr and hopefully he leads me into a Super Bowl so um, anyways what am I doing here <laughs> okay let me go back into the auction house I was looking for another uh, Derek Carr because uh, apparently there was no other that was cheap that's 4000 It was because all I saw was like 5000 I was like, what the fuck? There's no other like 4000 coin Derek Carr. So I had to go back into the auctions and see if there was like another cheaper one. Uh, because the only way you can actually break down a, a player if it's too expensive is by going into their team looking for that single person and you should be able to see a lot more offers into that person. So that's my tip to you guys if you guys want to see a more of a cheaper player make sure you go into that team and look for that person because that's the only way you can see more cards about that one person so here I am you know, looking for this Derek Carr and then all I see is the old uh, the original Derek Carr which is 81 overall but then I saw this one and I was like you know what I guess I'm gonna have to spend 5,000 coins for Derek Carr I mean I think it's worth it I mean 5,000 and 4,000 co coins just for this one Derek Carr that I'm about to get I mean it does look kind of worth it so there it is the double ground and pound Derek Carr is about to be given to me 1000 coins and there he is 87 overall Derek Carr with double ground and pound elite by the way so do you think this is worth it do you think it was a good pickup what do you guys think please tell me in the comment section right now if you guys think this was a good pickup because at this point I was like I'm just staring at the car I was like god damn I didn't know what's gonna be 87 overall I found out after the, a little bit like a little uh, after the video I actually went back and searched like why does this guy have 87 overall it's because it said right there that it can be added plus seven overall on the, on the current player so god damn it you know Derek Carr is gonna lead us into the Super Bowl I have a feeling he will as you can see he's a lot more better than Ryan Tannehill more speed more awareness more throwing power plus three on everything versus Ryan Tannehill as you can see the only thing Ryan Tannehill can actually beat Derek Carr on is on the play action and that's it and maybe one point in the elusiveness but the rest of the stats as you can see is plus three on everything throwing power 96 compared to 93 throwing accuracy maybe a little bit of throwing the deep on speed on awareness as you can see here's more of a broken down stats right here you can see how um, Derek Carr can actually make more of an impact than Ryan Tannehill so yeah so what do you guys think do you guys th think this is worth it or not because I think it is I think a little slight improvement to my quarterback position can actually you know work better with my with my team because the faster the ball travels the faster that pass is going to be completed into a player and the less percentage it has to be intercepted so I don't know I'm just leaving it up to you guys do you guys think this was a good idea and especially like for 9,000 coins because Jason Morrow, Jadavion Clowney and Cardell Patterson all of them 
would equal like around 20,000 each because every single car if you guys want, want to buy the original cars for the rising stars those costed like around 20,000 each or 10,000 each and I was spending that much coins on that on those guys but over here with their car I only spent like around 9,000 coins in order for me to, to get the rising star Derek car which is kind of weird so yeah I don't know why they're sending this guy for that cheap so that's it he's my starter and hopefully you guys enjoy the second half of the season